Hello and welcome to our architectural case study with the British Columbia Shake and Shingle Association. We're here on site in Abbotsford, British Columbia. Actually, this site contains three separate buildings with three separate organizations. The Canucks Place Children's Hospice, Dave Letty House, Matthews House Respite Center for Children, and the Abbotsford Hospice Society's Dave Holmberg House. So we're going to present this video as a work in progress. We'll illustrate the harmony of these three organizations in their unified collaboration and architectural vision that resulted in the showcase of these three fantastic buildings. All three of these structures have similar design profiles that complement each other, but the main visual connection among these buildings are the features of cedar shakes on the roof as well as cedar shingles on the walls. The warm, welcoming feeling that real cedar shakes and shingles provide is now being recognized and proven scientifically as beneficial to health and healing. All buildings, and especially institutional ones, are inherently stress-inducing because they contain an environment that humans do not fully comprehend. Adding wood to the environment reduces this stress because it is an element that we are inherently familiar with. With lower stress comes better healing. Wood elements in healthcare environments help foster healing by generating positive feelings, reducing stress, and increasing overall patient comfort as well as staff productivity. That's why hospital and institutional projects such as these are changing their appearance and design profiles from the cold, stark, impersonal concrete and metal forms of the past to the healing and wellness aura that real cedar provides. Humans have always benefited from wood, from providing heat and shelter, art and comfort. The irony is that we are now rediscovering the benefits of real cedar for our dwellings and buildings. The same reverence, appreciation and uses for cedar that our North American Indians showed our earliest settlers over two centuries ago is once again resurfacing in our modern era as architects, builders, and developers integrate real wood, including cedar shakes and shingles, in their construction projects, small or large, single residence to institutional and multi-use facilities. Now let's go to the mill and meet Ed Watkins, owner and manager of Watkins Sawmills, who supplied the fire-treated shakes for the roof as well as the cedar shingles for the sidewalls. So here we are with Ed Watkins of Watkins Sawmills and uh, we just came back from the beautiful project over in Abbotsford, the Canuck Place Children's Hospice, the Matthews House and the Abbotsford Hospice Society's Holmberg House. And it's so beautiful and fantastic and just like to ask you a couple of questions about the fire retardant for the cedar shakes on the roof and the beautiful cedar shingles for the sidewalls. So Ed, how long has the industry been fire treating cedar shakes and shingles? They've been in the industry over 50 years. Okay, 50 years of fire treatment. And just simply, what's the process? How are they dipped or sprayed or painted? No, actually uh, they're kill dried first to take all the moisture out of them. Then they're put in a pressure vessel and put under anywhere from 50 pounds to 150 pounds of PSI. And the actual chemical then is forced into the wood cells. And then the uh, product is taken out of the cylinder, uh, then put back in the, in, the, in the dry kills and taken up to uh, about 185 degrees. So the water is then taken out of uh, the product and there's a chemical reaction so the chemical actually bonds, impregnates permanently in the wood. So oh, it's a permanent process? It's a permanent process for the life of the wood. Oh, and you don't have to go back in five or ten years and retreat with anything? No, not, absolutely not. It's a permanent process. It, it's embedded into the wood. And Ed, what different classes of fire treatment are available? There are actually four classes. One is a Class A standalone that is the same as fire rating as concrete tile. Uh, the next is a Class A system, which is a Class B shake over a um, Class A uh, felt um, and then there's a class B product uh, and then a class C and then of course you 
from there you have raw shakes and shingles. So whatever <coughs> the local jurisdiction's calling for in the way of fire treatment, you guys can do? Absolutely, from anywhere from a class C to a class A or to a class A standalone. For the toughest fire ratings uh, in the world, we can meet them. Have you ever had a failure or a claim against fire treated shakes or shingles? Never had a failure. Okay. Never had a failure. Mm -hmm. So, would you recommend fire treated shakes wherever there is a requirement, no matter if it's for single family or multifamily or institutional? Yes, uh, our fire rated products from class B, C, B, and A are geared towards multifamily and commercial buildings because uh, there's tougher fire restrictions for those type of buildings. So an architect wouldn't have to be afraid that there would be a fire concern or an issue by specifying real cedar shakes and shingles with those fire ratings on them that they need? No, they are independently checked. We are monitored on a monthly basis, uh, tested on a quarterly basis. Our industry is the most severely and rap or repeatedly test industry in the world actually in the world roofing business no other so we 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 are we maintain a very high standard to meet all of these qualifications and all of these code restrictions uh, for any uh, building department in the, the US or North America or yeah. the world okay okay so uh, we were also very impressed with the shingle sidewalls that were going on the buildings all three buildings will have them yes and uh, here's your sample there but yeah. how do you produce the sidewall shingles that makes them so perfectly square and appealing on the walls well these first start off as a raw roofing shingle and um, then they are kill dried and then they are put through a machine that uh, automatically rebuts and resquares them so they're they're perfectly square and fit on the sidewall and will not have any shrinkage or crimpage um, and then some of them will be grooved to put different faces patterns on them or they will be stained different colors I think the case of this project it was a, a, a light brown color and so Ed these beautiful uh, stained shingles that you guys painted and stained at your factory they're ready to use right out of the box Absolutely, right out of the box uh, and, and you can nail them up right away and you don't have to worry about them again. So what would your recommendation be for use of fire treated shakes and sidewall shingles to an architect who might have interest in this project? Well the recommendation you can't beat the product for the look, for the natural beauty of it. Uh, it's a recyclable um, product, uh, it's a renewable resource. Um, it's, it's got great insulation factor. It's probably the best building material and product in the world. So uh, tell me, how long have you been in this business? Well, a long time. Uh, well, my family's been in the business since 1947. Uh, my grandfather started it in 47. My father took it over, then I took it over from my father. My son's in the business, and I've got three grandchildren coming into the business, too, someday. So we're working on the fifth generation. We're at the fourth right now. Fantastic. So this, this industry is, uh, is a strong industry. It's been around a long time. We make a great product and... Uh, you could say it's in your blood. Absolutely, it's in my blood. <laughs> we are very excited to have been a part of this fantastic project. We hope we have illustrated how the beauty, warmth, and inviting appearance of real cedar shakes and shingles make them the ideal roof and wall covering for almost any project. The BC Shake and Shingle Association has produced a number of educational and instructional videos covering every aspect of real cedar shakes and shingles from start to finish. Feel free to inspect our website as well as the videos, bcshakeshingle.com. Let us know if you have any questions we can assist with. Thank you.